everyone, it's Tay with Spectacular Gadgets. And in this video, I'm going to show you how I sanitize my devices. So no, I do not use Germex when I clean my devices, but instead I happen to purchase this cell phone sanitizer, which I purchased off of Amazon for about $26 and some change. So let's go ahead and take a look around the box and it says phone disinfector and it kills 99.99% of bacteria within six minutes. Turning it around on this side is just a picture and in this side it has main features which it effectively kills bacteria, viruses, fungi, and other bacteria effectively remove mold, cockro cockroaches, odor, and other organic odors. So you can go ahead and pause this if you'd like to go ahead and read the features and the main applications but let's go ahead and take the phone sanitizer out of the box. It is not the nicest presentation or box that I've seen, but for $26, I don't expect much. Here is the manual. And then lastly, I will pull out the power cable, which this cable is just a micro USB. All right, so let's go ahead and take a look at the manual. Cause I'm not really sure what is what. So let me focus this a little bit. And then it just gives the product features, uh, the specifications, and then what buttons do what. And that's what I was looking for. Okay. And then they give you just the operations guide and anything else that you might need. So I'll go ahead and take the bubble wrapping off of the phone sanitizer. Oops. Okay, so pulling this off, then I get a little bit of lazily wrapped plastic. Looks pretty lazy to me, but it's easy to pull off. And then it just reveals like a canister type. Here's where you'll plug in the cable, USB, five volt. And on the bottom, it's grippy, so it should not slide around. And there's really nothing else on the canister. So at the top, we have the buttons. And let's start with the right side. That's just to change the different color lights, to turn the lights on or off, and the actual sanitizer button. All right, so opening the lid, it goes pretty deep down in there, and you can also charge your device while it's in the canister. And here are where the light, or the, the UV lights come into play. So now we'll go ahead and unravel the cable. It's a decent length. So like I said before, it's USB to US, micro USB. I will go ahead and plug in the micro USB into the bottom of this. Type C is so much easier though. You just don't have to fiddle around with making sure you have it in the right direction. So turning on the light, you see, once I press the button, you see the light. I'm gonna go ahead and take my Umadigi and give her a bath or at least sanitizer. So I'll place her in there gently, close the lid. Let me straighten out the cable and I'll go ahead and press the sanitizer button. But let me go ahead and turn down all these lights that I have on so we can see. All right, so this is daylight in my studio. And as you see, it is sanitizing. It has a blue LED light to indicate that in fact, the phone sanitizer is doing its job. So that blue is just me playing around with the different co uh, color lights that this device has or this product. And you can actually use it for a night light. So that's just me pressing the different, cycling through the different colors. And so there's a good amount of them. And as you see on the bottom, the LED light is still blue. This process takes about six minutes for it to do what it needs to do. So six minutes is done and you see no more LED light. So we know where we are in the clear. I'll go ahead and open up the lid and pull out my cell phone and she is good to go. So that's cool. But let's go ahead and see if the big boy, the Mate 20X can fit in here. And we should know that it probably won't. Let's see. And I cannot close the lid and it's not gonna do its job. Let's go ahead and try my Note 9. I will gently place that inside, and yes, it does close, and we're good to go with that one. Not only does this product uh, sanitize phones, 
but I can also throw in my head, my earbuds. I can go ahead and throw in my Galaxy Watch. I can go ahead and throw in, hey, what the heck, my toothbrush. I can also go ahead and throw in my unboxing knife. What else do I have? Let me go ahead and throw in my chain. And I can sanitize all of these items. Uh, the box even said underwear and socks and whatever you want to throw in there. You can go ahead and do that. So this again is the phone sanitizer. Um, the company I believe is uh, LED MEI and uh, it's fairly easy to use. I'd say if you are a germaphobe or just want to keep your stuff sanitary, I would go ahead and pick up uh, one of these. There are several to choose from. I just happened to just pull the trigger on this one. And as I record this on January 1st of 2019, when I look back on Amazon, the item is no longer available. So, but like I said, there are other ones out there similar to this or it looks exactly like it, but it just has a different name, you can go ahead and pick them up. They're really inexpensive, and this could be a very useful household item. So, until next time, guys, peace.